Hello. Hello, Jorge. How are you today? Hello, Carlos. Hello, Wilfredo. Hello. Hi, Wilfredo. How are you? Hi, teacher. Good evening. So good far, so good, teacher. So far, so good. I like that. Yes. So far, so good. Very good. It's uh, the other the, uh, expression that you can use is uh, it's too early to say that. Yeah. It's too early. Too early. It's too, too, it's too early. Early. Yes. And, and what, the, what does it mean? When somebody asks you. Uh, no, no, in Spanish. When somebody asks you, how are you today? Oh my God, it's too early to say. Yes. Too early to say. It's the same. Is 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 the same that uh, so far so good. So, no. The, is similar meaning or no, is different? Too, too early to say is when whenever you have something to do and you don't know the outcome of it. Oh, oh. So I understood. Not, okay. You know if, gonna, if you're gonna be happy after the task, or you're gonna be, you know, upset after the task. So, so that's the reason you say it's too early to know. It's too, it's too <laughs> early to say that. To say that. Okay. Yeah, it's too early to say if I'm good or not. Hmm. All right. Okay, Jorge, how are you today? My goodness. My goodness. I I I tired. I thirsty. I hungry. <laughs> oh my God. Oh, and my back oh. my back is hurt. Oh my goodness. What happened to you yesterday? Ah, I feel so bad. Oh, okay. Only I, I hear the class. Okay. Okay. So okay. I, I, but, I, but how, how you... my back is hurt, but okay, but I am you, fine. You feel better today. Yeah, that's great. Excellent, excellent. That you feel better. And uh, all right. So let's see. We have uh, well, Mario is not gonna be there. I guess uh, his wife is still sick. And Giovanni Ramos Oyente, Carlos Antonio Rosales. Uh, Carlos, what happened to you? He's not there. In Okay, we have uh, mm, Melissa is going to be oyente, I don't know. Hello, Cesar Manfredi, how are you today? Hello, teacher. Uh, I'm fine. Uh, thank you. <laughs> how are you? <laughs> I'm doing fine, yes. Uh, I'm glad to hear that you are fine. Okay, and uh, uh, teacher was uh, was uh, complete the the, the my completed the the homework and on platform. Yes, uh, yes. But but uh, there is there is one uh, uh, ayuna que no pude. Okay. Okay, there is one that I wasn't able to do. Yes, is that what you want to say? There is one that I wasn't able to do. I went over the platform and I was trying to find out what uh, uh, exercise number you were working on and I wasn't able to find it. Can you tell me um, what section you were working on? The section is Four, uh, number number seventeen. Okay, section four, number seventeen. Let me check. Let me check. Uh, mm -hmm. Okay. Let's uh -huh. see. The section four. Okay. Let uh, Let's do it together. Uh, the exercise 17, the homework 17. Exercise 17, okay. Let's, uh, let's see, let's see. Wilfredo is there, Wilfredo can help us too. So it's uh, section two, right? Section mm -hmm. two, this one? No, section four. Oh, four. section four. Oh, okay, section four right here, okay. Mm -hmm. 
Yeah, I went over section one and section two, and uh, we didn't have a going to. Yes, okay. I'm going to. I, I, use, I use the. Uh, 60, 17. Uh -huh. Okay. Number, number, number four. Okay. I use. I use uh, the 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 of the form of to be of okay. to be and plus going to, but uh, say me is wrong form. Yes, so so the first one will be uh, he is going to phone his friends, right? Yes, uh, okay. I, no, I no tengo problema. Yes, uh, only only no, number four. He's going to phone his friend. Yeah. Number two will be, we are going, to, we are going to play a new computer. Mm -hmm. Okay. And number three will be, my sister mm -hmm. is going to watch a TV. Yeah. Yes. Uh, by By the way, uh, I I'll send you uh, the the screenshot. Uh, your mm -hmm. number number phone. Okay, uh, and this one says. Uh, uh, to have a picnic. Mm -hmm. What did you, you are, put? You are going. You are going to to have a picnic. Picnic. To have a picnic. Picnic. Next. So you're ha you're going to have a picnic next Tuesday. Is is this what you you have? Yes. Okay. Okay. Let's see. And the last one will be Jane is Jane is going going to the office yeah mm -hmm. jane is going to the office so the one you have problem is number four you are going to have uh, a picnic and to have a picnic next tuesday yeah and what is the problem with this one uh, the problem is a uh, 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 it doesn't it doesn't take it uh -huh, it says, it, says it, it is wrong uh -huh. teacher yes uh, lo que sucede es que si lleva un punto lleva una interrogante o algo se lo toma en malo aunque esté bueno uh -huh. si él no pone el punto se lo toma como malo. A eso es lo que ha sucedido a veces en la plataforma. Ok, entonces, ¿lo tienes así como lo tengo yo o hay algo diferente? Uh, different. Uh, only, only use uh, verb to, uh, the form to be and plus going to and the, the verb, the, uh, the words or the verb in brackets. Ok, so... It, so you yes, are, in, that, in that case we don't we don't we don't need to use we don't need, we don't need to write uh, the whole sentence just the verb to be and the words in brackets. So you're going to have uh, uh, you okay. are going to have just that just this yes I I are are going to have no, no, he says that the right that you are going to have and not, not the whole sentence. That's what uh, Wilfredo says. 
-hmm. but we must omit the the you the pronoun okay so you're gonna you uh omit the uh the pronoun are going to have ah. yes i can i can now it worked Pero, but, pero, if, but if you also meet it, uh, you will have a, a mistake. It will okay, give me a mistake? Okay. It will give me an yes. error? Yes. Okay, let me see. Yeah. I got all, all of them. In this case, teacher, it's Todas son así como en el ejemplo de la cuatro. Todas son así como en el ejemplo de la cuatro, pero la cuatro está buena en teoría, así como se está haciendo. Solo que siempre la marca mala. Ajá. En este caso puede probar con la primera, solo poniéndole is going to phone. Sí, porque ya, 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 ya pude. Ok, entonces dice, pero, pero Wilfred, me enfredo para los demás. Dice, complete the sentences using the form of be plus going to. Entonces, esto es lo que tenemos que hacer. Mm -hmm. B plus going to plus the verb in the bracket. So, esto es lo que nos piden, ¿verdad? Entonces, aquí mm -hmm. tenemos que omitir esto, ¿ya? Yeah? Y ya cumplimos con el, el B. Luego dice yes. el going to, aquí tenemos el going to y con el to, ¿verdad? Y luego the verb in brackets, dice phone. Entonces, uh, esto de aquí está de más, ¿ya? Yeah? Esto es además, he is mm -hmm. going to phone, porque eso es lo que está pidiendo allí. Vamos a ver. Vamos a submit esta, vamos a ver qué pasa. Ya, yeah. y ya nos dio la correcta. Sí. Mm -hmm. Entonces, si quitamos las otras, dejamos el verb to be, más going, going to. También si lo escribimos mal, ver que ahí estaba mal escrito. Si lo escribimos mal, entonces no trabaja. Y dejamos el verbo. ¿Ya? Yeah. Are going to play. Y venimos y we verified if it is correct. ¿Ya? Y lo chequeamos. Dice, ok, it works. Now le quitamos esto. Aquí que falta, my sister. Ese es, no, porque no es verb to be. Lo dejamos hasta el verb to be. It's going to watch. Y le quitamos mm -hmm. TV. ¿Ya? Yeah. Y lo verificamos, ya. Yeah. We verified it and see if, uh, if it is okay. Yeah, it is okay. Esta, are going to have. Y aquí, ¿cuál es el problema? You are going to have a picnic. You need, you need uh, as a you. You are. You are going to have. ¿Por qué? Quizás es un error, teacher, porque ¿Sí? en realidad está bien así como lo, lo ¿Sí? han estructurado. Sí, ahí. Ve, ve. To ve. A picnic. No, pero, pero es que, yeah, la, lo, que tenemos que yeah, lo que tenemos que encontrar es dónde está el error. Si estamos cometiendo uh -huh. nosotros error o es la plataforma. Uh -huh. Por ejemplo, the verificamos, platform. verificamos the el B. Uh -huh. Tenemos aquí el B. Sí, aquí está el B. Tenemos el going to, con esto, le dice, y going, going to, to. Yes, aquí lo tenemos. Y el verb in brackets, That's yes, lo tenemos have. el verb in brackets. Picnic. Have. have. Mm -hmm. Picnic. ¿Ah? Picnic, put picnic. No, 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 no. no, no. Eso, eso es lo que quiero yo que aprendamos. O sea, de no ir como, como ok, posiblemente es no. Estar seguro de lo que estamos haciendo. Lo que Ajá. nos están pidiendo es el be, el verb to be, plus going to, plus the verb in bracket. Entonces, we have a verb to be, going to, plus verb in bracket, el have. Es lo que hemos venido haciendo aquí. Sí. Is going va, va a tener, dice, va a tener, va a tener, va a tener un picnic. Por eso digo picnic. No, pero no sí. se necesita en este caso. Jorge, no. Jorge, 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 lo que quiero es que veas. Que... Ok, I listen. Yeah, Jorge, que el, el patrón que estamos siguiendo es solamente el verb to be, el going to y el verb. Eso es lo que nos pide la plataforma. 
Y estamos yeah. haciendo eso en todas, sí, en todas, eso hemos dicho, ¿ve? Going to be el verb, going to be el verb. Verb uh -huh. to be, going to be y verb. Y aquí, verb to be, going to y el verb. Y aquí lo mismo tenemos, going to, al menos que lo estemos escribiendo mal. Pero no, el spelling lo veo correcto yo. Ahora vamos a ver en este. Vamos a ver, dejamos el verb to be, el going to y el verb que es el of go, ¿verdad? ¿Ya? Yeah. ¿Sí? Jane go. is going to go yeah, to the office. Ya, yeah, vamos a ver si lo, lo está bien. Y si está bien, entonces quiere decir que la plataforma no está correcta. Ya. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Ese es el problema, la plataforma no está correcta porque ya lo verificamos. Ahora sí, yo puedo mandar un mensaje y decir, hey, ¿saben qué? Eh, la... la el ejercicio número 4 de, 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 de la number 7, o oh, 17 es este, ¿verdad? 17-4, yeah. Eh, homework 17-4, exercise 17-4, es wrong. Yes, le puedo mandar así eso porque ya corroboramos y, y, y eso es. Pero si yo estoy poniendo otras palabras, por ejemplo, picnic next to, y no, eso ya es. Querer poner lo que tiene la plataforma y no lo que sabe. Uh -huh. Teacher. Yes. Uh, press show answer. ¿Hmm? Press no. show answer. Oh, no, no, sí, sí, eso lo podemos hacer. Sí, eso, es, eso es fácil, ¿verdad? Ok, press for answer y vemos la respuesta, pero queremos ver si nosotros sabemos lo que estamos haciendo. Eso es. Eso no. es. We are okay, but. Ajá. Uh -huh. for uh, what day? Teacher. Yeah. Uh -huh. in, the, in, the, in this case, I had I had to add a uh, you. Uh, okay. Uh, uh -huh. Yeah. Yo, yo, entonces, yeah. Hay, hay alguien que está haciendo esto en la esto le pone en la plataforma le pone esta respuesta. Entonces, uh -huh. eh, al, eh, no estuvo bien porque le agregaron el you por mistake. Fue un mistake. Uh -huh. Yeah. Uh -huh. Entonces aquí le ponemos esto. Ya. Yeah. Ya. Yeah. Dice que es correcta, pero Basado en las, en las instrucciones, no está correcta, porque no, no nunca correcta. me dijeron que le pusiera el, el pronoun, ¿sí? Ajá. El pronoun no tengo que ponérselo yo, ¿ya? Entonces, eso es un error. No es error, error de ustedes, sino que es error de, de la plataforma. Ok. Eh, very good, excelente. Good job, uh, Manfredo. Good job, Jorge. Good job, Wilfredo. Eh, de eso se trata el ejercicio. El verb to be. El going to y el verb. Es todo. Eso lo aprendí. Good job. Excelente. Ok, very good. My goodness. Yes. We did it. <laughs> no, we did it. We did it. Yeah, we did it. We, we are, we're marvelous working together. Esmeralda. My goodness. There you are. Jesus Christ. We miss you yesterday. Uh, sorry, teacher. Yes. Yesterday, I was very tired. Yes, yesterday, And all my troubles. Por eso que se oían aquí hasta Z, hasta Z se oían. Well, welcome to your class, uh, Esmeralda. We're, we are glad to see you, okay? Very good, excellent. Senia, Judith, how are you today? Hello, I am fine. Oh my goodness, very good. Nice to see you. Nice to see you too. Okay, we we're working on uh, exercise 17, uh, number four. Uh, because uh, for some reason, the platform it doesn't have the uh, correct answer. And we have to add the, uh, the uh, pronoun you to the answer, but it's not correct. Okay, so if you add the word you, it means that uh, it's not correct because uh, the instructions never uh, mention that we have to add the pronoun to the answer. It only requests you to put the verb to be, the word going to, and the verb. Those are the three, uh, 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 Things that you have to uh, uh, include in your response. Okay, so 
So that's whenever you get to uh, 17, four. So you get the, um, the answer for that question. Okay, very good. So let's uh, go over what we learned yesterday or oh, we went over something yesterday. What did we learn yesterday? Anything, cualquier cosa. ¿Alguien? ¿Nadie? ¿Qué eh, aprendimos ayer? Algo que aprend hayamos aprendido ayer. Yesterday we were talking about uh, companies' expertise, expertises and his industrial classification. Okay, very good. And, and let me see. Uh, uh, and we have a homework for today. <laughs> for today was uh, the presentation for today, yes. But besides that, we learned something about questions, two types of questions that we uh, usually are the, the, the main uh, questions that we use in the English language. Which one are they? Information question and yes or no question. Information question and yes or no question. And what is the particularity of the information question? The information question is uh, the difference in that we add some, uh, some more information and that we don't know and is a, a more long answer. Uh, answer. Uh, difference between yes answer answer is the difference between the yes or no question because yes, yes or no question is easier to uh, to respond or reply because we should we must we only should yeah, should say yes or not yes and uh, yes and it's uh, very boring right uh, to to have a to held a conversation where the person is only asking me yes and no uh, question I, are you hungry? Yes. Do you like pizza? Yes. Uh, do you work? Yes. Um, are you married? Yes. Um, are you single? Yes. Do you have a girlfriend? Yes. Uh, it's very, very, it, it's, it's like a boring, right? To say, okay, stop. Don't ask me anymore. It's like a, the FBI is interrogating you, right? But uh, the information questions are open questions where you uh, want to find a piece of information that you never mentioned in the question. That is the peculiarity of it. For example, uh, Esmeralda, what do you do for a living? I'm working. Yes. I am teacher. Yes, I, I'm working as a teacher. That is what I do for a living. Okay, that would be a, a closed question. Now the open one is the one, okay, in, in your job, it tell me what is uh, the most exciting, yes, a, a, a situation that you have had this weekend? Yes. Entonces, ya esa pregunta es más abierta. Más, o sea, ¿Cuál es la, la cosa más emocionante que hiciste este fin de semana. Yeah. Ya ella tiene, she has to elaborate the answer. It's not uh, just, oh, good. <laughs> oh, well, it was nice. Yeah. No, she has to elaborate. Oh my God, I remember. Well, there were more than one thing that I did that it was very excited. Yeah. The first one is blah, 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 blah. Second one is this, blah, blah. And, and the last one that it was hilarious one, yes. Y empieza, yeah, empieza a hablar. So that's the reason why we use uh, 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 information question. Y eso es lo que vimos ayer, ¿ok? Eh, hoy vamos a ver acerca de networking. ¿Qué entendemos con la palabra networking? O what is networking for you, uh, Senia? Mm, no sé, me va a decir porque está haciendo otra cosa. Me va a decir, no sé, teacher, no sé. No, eh, internet, communication, eh, redes, no sé. Ya sabía que me decía. It's my, it's my idea. Ok. <laughs> ok, bien. Yeah. 
Ok. Es que, vea, en su, en su, en su, aquí, en su, eh, se le refleja la pantalla y, y, y se ve cuando la cambia así la pantalla. Vi cuando la cambió. <laughs> ok, networking. Um, uh, Jorge, what is networking for you? It's an uh, in, internal uh, website of the company. Okay. Uh, it's the communication internal of the company. Okay. Uh, uh, in the system. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. And uh, Gomez, what is the... Like I say, uh, Asenia. Yes, yes, yes. So, Gomez, what is a, a network for you? Or oh, networking? Yeah, what is networking for you? No, no, I don't understand. Okay. ¿Qué es uh, eh, redes? ¿Sería en español? Oh, ¿Cómo sería en español? Network. Ah, uh, uh, redes. Uh, uh, en español uh, es redes. Redes. Uh, uh, ok. Networking. Uh, no, no, more, no, much, no sé de redes. <laughs> I okay. don't know. Okay, very good. Uh, Esmeralda, what is networking for you? Pues yo, igual, um, imagino que tiene que ver con internet y toda esa cosa. Okay, is this, okay, very good. Uh, Edgar, what is networking for you? Uh, for me, well, I think, so the perfect, Performance, the action by professionals. That would be networking. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Very good. And Dennis, can you talk? Network. Yes. Network. Yes. Eh, bueno, uh -huh. redes al final se puede aplicar para muchas cosas, pero puede ser múltiples estaciones de trabajo. Okay. Eso sería como networking. Sí, okay. sí. Okay. Puede aplicarse okay. tanto computadoras, trabajo y todo. Ok, yes, por ahí vamos, más o menos. Uh, uh, Wilfred, what is networking for you? Uh, um, networking, um, I think it's uh, like a, a way or a process of interacting with others in order to, to exchange information, I think. Ok, ok, so... If, if we're talking about computers, um, it will be uh, a group of computers connected together and sharing some resources. Yes, that will be a networking, computers networking. But uh, since we're not talking about uh, that type of networking, we're talking about uh, people networking. We're talking about uh, professionals networking. We are talking about businesses networking, yeah? So if, if a, net, a computer network are, is, is a, a group of computers connected together, sharing information and sharing resources, a resource will be like a, a printer. Yes, one printer for the whole network where everybody is able to, to send printouts to that printer. So the is a network, a share, a group of computers sharing the resource, which is the printer. But that's computers. Now let's uh, put that information into people. In this case, since we're talking about businesses, yes, we're gonna be talking about uh, networking, business networking. What is a networking in business? Cesar, yes. Oh, you have a problem with your audio, okay. Oh, okay, so what is uh, networking in business? Like uh, Wilfredo said, is, is the interaction or engaging, yes. Interaction is uh, uh, when, when you talk to other people, you interact, or when you relate to other people, you interact like computers working together, yeah. 
for one specific objective. Yes. So people working for the same purpose. That is a networking in business, interacting and engaging with people for what? For mutual benefit, for something that benefits everybody in that group of businesses. Yeah. For example, I don't know if you ever if you ever been in a business when you are looking for a product. Let's say that, that you go to a, a hardware store, yes, and you're looking for a, a shovel, a shovel, una pala, yeah, shovel. The, the one you want, the hardware store doesn't have the type of shovel that you're looking for. So they call to all the businesses. They call to all the businesses and say, hey, uh, this is uh, Antonio. I work for uh, what? Uh, um, hardware store, the uh, uh, Machuca's hardware store. Yes, and I would like to know if you have this type of uh, travel. And the person over there said, yes, we do have it. Okay, can you send it to me, please? How much time do you need to send that uh, travel to me? Oh, two hours. And then this person who just called the other business goes and tell the, the customer, you know what? Yes, we have it. But it doesn't mean that they have it. It's the networking. Yes, networking, business networking, that they help each other for the same purpose or mutual benefit. Because the other business wants to sell the product and you want to keep your customer. So even though if you don't make any profit on that sales, you keep your customers happy. And that is what business is about. To maintain or to keep your customers happy. Yes. Yeah. So it's like in, in your in your home, in your marriage. A happy woman, happy home. Yes. A happy woman, remember, happy home. Yes. So in businesses, it's like that. Okay. Happy customers, good business. Mad customers, no business at all. So networking in business is the interaction or engaging and engaging we can put with people the interaction with people for mutual benefit that's that's all that's that's a networking am, am i clear is that clear yes, no? yes okay solo solo yes, with friends okay solo with friends or oh, everybody else yeah so when we talk about the networking in business, when we talk about networking in business, you have to, okay, oh, I know what you're talking about. Oh, when we say chamber of commerce, have you ever heard the word chamber of commerce? No? La Cámara de Comercio? En español, sí. Ahí sí, oh, yes, chiste, chiste. Chamber of commerce, yes. ¿Se acuerdan la, la chamber of uh, gas chamber que tenía Hitler? Hi, Hitler. Chamber en la cámara. Yes, chamber. Y así se escribe. Chamber of commerce. Chamber of secrets. Yes. Of chamber. Harry Potter. <laughs> yeah, there you go. La cámara de secretos. Chamber of commerce. What is a chamber of commerce? Yeah, it's a group of entrepreneurs. Es un grupo de, de entrepreneurs. Se dice... Eh, emprendedores. Yeah. It's a group of entrepreneurs that offers opportunities, yes, or referrals in, in business development. Yeah, esa es, esa es una cámara de comercio que le ofrece oportunidades o, o, o referencias, yes, eh, y también eh, el desarrollo de, de negocios. Esa es una chamber of, uh, uh, of commerce, yes, cámara de comercio. Ese es el trabajo de ellos, es la función de ellos. Usted va ahí y ahí es donde se hace networking. Y es business networking. So, si quiere, permitir, si quiere pertenecer a un networking y darse cuenta de todos los, los negocios que hay, vaya al Chamber of Commerce. Y you have to sign o algo tiene que hacer ahí para pertenecer a ese, a ese grupo. Ok, so, but the word that I want you to learn is... Uh, uh, business networking. What is a business network? So it's a group of businesses uh, uh, in that interchange information uh, for the same purpose. 
for mutual mutual um, uh, benefits. Yes, that's that's the whole thing. Mutual benefit. Everybody is seeking their own benefits. Okay, that is uh, what we're going to be uh, reading about today. And let's see. Let's start with. Uh, with the uh, the first presentation, I'm going to ask uh, Wilfredo if we can if we can hear his uh, presentation uh, today. If I may ask him. Yeah. Oh, podemos tener Senia. Senia se ve que está bien preparada. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Bien? Yes, teacher. Ladies first. Ladies <laughs> first. Okay, okay, okay. Senia, please. Okay. Hello, my name is Senia Peña. Tonight, introduce the company Fundación Crisalida Internacional, known as Glasgow International, is a NGO. The expertise is the resource mobilization. In 2007, Selena de Sola, along with her brother Diego and her husband, Ken Baker, founded Glasgow International in San Salvador. The concept was simple, foster change by investing in a community's existing strength and resource. It is infra infra infrastructure, infrastructure. infrastructure and its people. The headquarters is in El Salvador, the branch is um, Guatemala, Honduras, Costa Rica, Panama, Colombia, Mexico, USA, Republic of The name is by butterflies have long been considered symbols of, of positive transformation. It's my work. That's uh, in, in international. Thank for your attention. Very good, my goodness. Very good. Yeah, very good. Excellent. Good job. Thank you. You're welcome. Well, thank you, Senia, for your presentation. It was very good. Excellent. Good job. Okay. Ahora, ladies first. Ahora, Wilfredo, ¿verdad? <laughs> okay, teacher. Y después, uh, vamos a tener Jorge. Y después, César Servillón. Después, Gómez. Y después, Emerson. Okay. Después María, Jesús. Okay. Okay. Uh, good evening, everyone. My good name evening. is Wilfredo Luna. And I'm going to try to explain you about the company I'm working for. Uh, the, the name of the company is Fruit of the Loom. And I'm going to try to explain you about the expertise, its industrial classification, some branches, and the headquarters. Okay, let's start. Um, the company's expertise, uh, Fruit of the Loom is an organization capable of adapting to a changing and competitive environment that offers sustained growth in operating profits uh, and leadership in our commitment to people and the environment. Okay, uh, his industrial classification is in manufacturing industry. Uh, this company has many branches, um, has uh, branches in America, Europe, Asia, Africa, Middle East, and Australia. And his headquarter is in the United States. Uh, thank you all of you for your attention. Right, yeah, excellent, my goodness. Good job, good job. Yeah. Oh my goodness. Very good, good presentation. Now let me hear uh, Jorge. Okay, teacher, I now have uh, more information about my company because it's it. Now I have information and in the network and the page, internet page in the, my company, and I have more information, but I try. Okay. Only I... Um, uh, good evening, everyone. Uh, my name is Jorge Alberto Orellana. I work in, in global developers. I am a multi, um, multinational company dedicated to the, the 
the developers of real estate projects, creating values uh, for its client, shareholders, and collaborators. It's uh, the experience of building and making cities with more than uh, 5,000 homes. This is characteristic with its integrated designing and motivated to build homes that can offer a solid support to its client, improving quality and life and urban aesthetic. Uh, the values of my company is confidence, ethics, respect, innovation, and responsibility. Uh, that's all. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Very good. Uh, solo nos faltó la, la, la industry a la que la compañía pertenece, ¿verdad? A uh, multinational company, the KD and the developer a real estate project. No, la, la... Uh, it's a, uh, 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 sorry, it's a, uh, uh, da, 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 da. Creating home. So it's in the construction industry. Construction, yes. And finance. And finance okay. because uh, the money for the projects sí, is pero, a finance y a construction. Sí, no, pero el, el, la industry, ¿te acuerdas que aprendimos de eso? La industry, ¿a qué industry pertenece? ¿Eh, ¿Pertenece a business o, por ejemplo, el banco? A, 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 a las dos, a, las, a ambas pertenece. Es financiera, tanto como financiera y tanto como constructora. Okay. Financiera es una industria. Es, sí, porque es como un banco, pues, pero es un banco privado solamente de, de accionistas, nada más. Okay. O sea, hay, cierta, hay ciertas accionistas eh, y proponen los proyectos. Ok, ok, so, ok. So. Pero también ellos tienen sus propios proyectos. O sea, por darle un ejemplo. They have their own project. Usted llega con, con un proyecto a mi empresa. Yes. Vaya, yo necesito tanto dinero para que hacer este proyecto. Ah, vaya, chivo, aquí te lo damos. Yeah. Pero es tu proyecto y tú okay. solo nos quedas pagando. O sea, so those, those somos... are, those are uh, uh, your company's expertise. Mm -hmm. ¿Sí? Sorry. Uh, those are your company's expertise. 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 De los, Sorry, que, ellos, I, I, de los que ellos se. se, se eh, o sea, eso es su. En español es, es experticia, o de lo que son expertos ellos. Uh, sí, en, en las dos cosas. Ok, ok. Eh, Very good. Excellent. Ok. Very good. Excellent. Good job, Jorge. Good job. Bien. Thanks. Oye, y, y que no tenés información, y si hubieras tenido información, my goodness, that's a good uh, presentation, good job. Excellent. Yeah. Sí, eh, créame, estuve investigando, porque al menos ayer estuve escuchando la clase, pero sí estuve al tanto de, la, de, la, de las tareas, y okay. estuve buscando en todo, y solo eso encontré. Ok, very good, excellent, good job, good job. Ok, César. Can I can I share my 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 slide? Your PowerPoint. Mm, my screenshot. My screenshot. Pantalla. Acá. Sí, your, your window. Si te deja, if uh, if uh, me lo enviaste al, al WhatsApp, no. No. Uh, El anfitrión inhabilitó la función de compartir la pantalla. Enviado el WhatsApp. Okay. 
give me give me a second give me a second, second please okay uh, take your time En lo que tú estás haciendo eso, uh, voy a pasar lista, ¿ok? Ok. Ok. Uh, Carlos Rosales. No. César Manfredi, sí, yes, ahí está, César Manfredi. Dennis Vladimir. Present. Thank you, sir. Edgar Edemir Pineda. No. Present. Okay, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Eh, Edgar, ¿verdad? Yes. Edwin Alexis. Uh, teacher, sí, dígame, dígame. Sorry. Sorry. Uh, I have a problem with my internet. Uh, not put my camera. Okay, okay, don't worry. Thank you for letting me know. Gracias por uh, de comunicarme. Okay, Emerson Eli Moreira. Presente, teacher. Thank you. Eric Armando. Present, teacher. Thank you. Esmeralda Noemi López. Present teacher. Thank you. Giovanni Alexander. Present teacher. Thank you. Imer Alberto Sanchez. Present teacher. Thank you. Jacob de Jesus Gomez. Present teacher. Thank you. Jonathan Salvador Zavala. Present teacher. Thank you. Jorge Alberto Rellano Martinez. Present teacher. Thank you. Julia Margarita Chicas, no. Y María Jesús Martínez. Present. Thank you. Mario Osvaldo Martínez. Present. Thank you. Y Melissa Esther Orellana Rivas. Present teacher. Thank you. Sandra Janet Benítez. No. Ok. Senia Judith. Present. Thank you. And Wilfredo Antonio Luna. Present. Thank you, sir. Okay, Manfredi, ready? No, not yet. Ya mandé la my presentation. Ya lo veo aquí. On chat. On chat. Sí, ya, ya es, voy a abrirlo ahorita. Ok. Tenemos aquí Freddy. Just a second. Es Rex, ¿verdad? Rex PPTX. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes. Ok, just a second. Okay, Luvia, I'm going to open it for you. Just give me a second. It looks nice. And is this your company? Yes. So oh, this yes. is the, the company that you work for. I I can I can I can't uh, I can watch the my presentation. Okay, just uh, 
I'm opening the uh, PowerPoint presentation. I downloaded it. Uh, now I just need to have this one open in just a second. Okay, one moment. One second. <clears throat> Anybody else has another presentation so they can send it and uh, I can have them ready for you. Just let's see. One second. Time. He doesn't want to collaborate. Okay. Well, just, uh, just to say, no, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Al almost done. Espérate, my Freddy. Just a second. Just give me a second. <laughs> okay. Yeah. It's almost done. It's fifty percent. Okay, 70%. Okay. Okay, here we go. Okay, got it. Okay, can you see it? No. No, okay. Not yet, teacher. Okay. Ah. <clears throat> can you see it now? Yes, yes. Okay, just give me a second so I can put this one. Press habilitar edición. Sí. Just a second. No, no, me dice la computadora. <laughs> ok. Ya habilité la esa y se cerró. <laughs> ok. Ok, vamos a ver. Ah, voy a compartir otra vez pantalla. Y díganme si la ven. Yes. Okay. Ahora, uh, 
Voy a cerrar esto. Ah, because the list. Dele, dele, F, F5, dele. Ok, bueno, F5. Ahí va. Uh -huh. There we go. <coughs> yes. Can you okay. see it now? Uh, thank you. <laughs> no, thank you for your wait, waiting time. Okay. Okay, go ahead. Okay. Uh, good evening, everyone. Good evening. Uh, tonight, uh, I'm, go I'm going to talk uh, about uh, my, 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 thank you, me, about Saram uh, CSV, Alimentos Mook. It's a, uh, um, it's an animal, it's an animal uh, feed food uh, industry. And, and we have a social responsibility. Uh, I, it's a, a, a public, public, public um, trader company. Uh, the, um, his located is a uh, kil kilometer uh, 25 uh, kilometer y medio in front of Lismar, Carretera Los Naranjos, uh, Cincinnati. And what the mission is we are we are company focus on providing the quality of life and the nutrition of people. Uh, the people uh, throw the, the, the development of efficient food system. Uh, the vision is uh, to be to be the leading Central America and Caribbean regional corporation. Um, the values, uh, some values is a real, real. Reliability. Re reliability, transparency, commitment, uh, crea creativity, and productivity. Mm -hmm. uh, next. Okay. Well done. <clears throat> okay, next. Oh, next. Okay. Um, the, the company is considered as a first uh, total plant in, in El Salvador to be able to offer the market, the market food um, for, for all spe species. In the three notes presentation floor, uh, Pele, 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 Bueno, ahí es pelletizado, no, no. Pel hay, uh, pelletized. Pelletized and extruded. Mm -hmm. uh, the company is now uh, as a major, major produce or food uh, for all species. Species. Uh, species, yeah. Species, uh, for example, uh, chicken, horse, and pig. Mm, cow and and duck. Uh, the the brand aliment uh, the brand the, the brand aliment aliment more is considered the, the leader in the produce of food for, for for all species. Mm -hmm. It's a company that develops a lot of technology technological innovation for customer satisfaction and service. I I should mention the uh, the the ones that have no branches in, in El Salvador, okay. but have <sighs> but have uh, some chicken and and pig farms. Okay. Uh, next, uh, 
this is a, a sample of the rest or session organizational chart. Mm -hmm. Right. Uh, will be the general ma yeah. manager and um, internal auditor. He is a internal head of internal audit, internal assistant. And then uh, the the there are the all management, financial, administrative, I, IT, production, production, marketing, manage, management, and sales manager. Uh, the the other uh, management mm -hmm. and 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 someone. Uh, uh, some uh, departments, uh, uh, accountant, human resource, uh, production man uh, manager, uh, production, and uh, only that. Okay, only that. My God, that's a lot. Thank you. Thank you very much. Very good. Good job. Good job, good job. Thank I'm you. sorry. I'm sorry for my my travation. <laughs> no, no, no. You you're great. You're great. Excellent. I I I appreciate your participation. You're great. You're doing a wonderful job, Manfredi. Congratulations. Very good. Congratulations, all of you. My goodness. Uh, I'm impressed. So let, let's go ahead and take a 10 minute break so you can breathe and uh, take a cup of coffee uh, before you go to sleep. <laughs> You're gonna fall asleep. So uh, take a break, 10 minutes, and I see you in 10 minutes, okay? Thank you for- Ya le di tiempo, ya le di tiempo, prepárense. <laughs>
Okay, let's uh, let's continue with the class. Thank you, Cesar Manfredi, for your presentation. Now, the, let me have uh, next presentation. If we can start with the next presentation, so we can finish as soon as possible. <laughs> Okay, if I can have uh, um, Jacobo, are you there? Not yet, okay, Maria? Hello, good evening. Good evening, uh, go ahead. Hello. Sí, 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 go ahead. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. My name is Maria Jesus Martinez. I work in Fruit of Balloon Corporation. Incorporation. Y this company is recognized as a very prestigious company. Uh, we manufacture underwear. And we are in textile industry. The company values is innovation, respect, responsibility, uh, service to the community. And we have five branches in El Salvador. And we have other branches in Honduras, Mexico, India, uh, Marruecos, Haiti. The headquarters wow. is in the United States. That's all. Uh -huh. Okay, very good. Excellent. Good job. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, Gomez. Okay, teacher. Good evening, everyone. Uh, I work in Taller Sarti or Bocho Sarti. And the company where I work is an expert, expert in machine materials. materials. Okay. It's located, it's located in San Salvador. A classified industry, a steel industry, a processing steel. Is the main floor. A certain workshop do not have branches. A headquarters but solamente. Okay, very good. Excellent. Good job. Okay. Very good. Excellent. Okay, uh, Edwin. Hi, teacher. Good evening. Hi. Good evening, sir. Okay. Este. Hello, my name is Edwin Rodriguez. Hi. Nice to meet you. Nice. I work in Taller Sarti. And what does Taller Sarti do? In the company, we take we take care of producing from the zero point a major town to become the work of a special magazine. And we don't have branches in the country and headquarters is in El Salvador. Okay. Very good. Finish. Very good. And uh, the industry, I didn't get the industry. Sorry? The industry, what industry do your company belongs to? It's a construction industry, uh, food industry. La industria, a que industria pertenece? Um, uh, industrial uh, manufacturing. Manufacturing industry, okay, okay, very good. Excellent, good job, thank you, thank you very much. Okay, uh, Edgar Pineda, please. Okay. Uh, good evening. Good evening. Uh, my name is uh, Edgar Pineda. I am working in the Ironman. Uh, the company specializes in aeronautical maintenance uh, solution. Uh, reaches uh, 40 years old. And and Arman is the industry leader in providing airframe, heavy maintenance, and provide service to 
aircraft of the brands, different brands, uh, Airbus, Boeing, and Embraer. And, and, and we have cons consistently provide the best in class service and solution and, and different uh, and different service and between the modification, maintenance preventing and and correctly. And we have a uh, six hangar and and there is inside our 25 uh, aircraft simulation and uh, Aeroman is one is one of the world's largest aviation maintenance components with capacity to service over 35 aircraft. Only that. Oh my goodness, that's a huge company. Very good, excellent. Thank you. Huge, huge company. Compañía grande. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Very good. Thank ah, um, I remember. Uh, this is branched in the Mexico, and and USA, and Herman headquarters and El Salvador. Okay. Very good. Excellent. Yeah, you mentioned you. that uh, yesterday, and I was surprised that uh, the headquarters are uh, here in El Salvador, and the branches in the United States. Uh, it's it's uh, uh, unbelievable. Yeah. Yeah. Very good. Excellent. Okay. Thank you, yeah. Edgar. Uh, Emerson. Hi, teacher. Hi. Eh, eh, yo lo había escrito, lo había anotado algo cortito, teacher. No, no hay problema. Lo importante es que dé su presentación. Y go ahead. Okay. Not a problem. Uh, good evening. My name is Emerson. Okay. I work in a counting fear in the capital. Mm -hmm. It does not have other branches. It is small. Um, in the office, we are only four people. And we offer service. Thank you for the attention. Okay, so what uh, the company specializes on? Uh, what specializes in? So what do they do? Ah, uh, uh, what is my special? The special. companies. The companies. Uh, do you do uh, phone services, computer services, uh, business services? What do you do? What do you do? Um, la compañía, la compañía. I, uh, the company to make uh, reports, finances. <laughs> finances reports? It's, yes. Okay. It's like um, a, accounting? Yes, accountant. Okay, so, so you offered the um what supports to company so you do the general ledger so what do you guys do um o sea me está preguntando que si qué hace la empresa verdad o, o, el ejercicio era eh, decir a qué qué empresa estabas representando dónde trabajas cuáles son las las ex ex expertise o sea las experticias de tu compañía ¿Y a qué eh, industria pertenece? Uh, uh -huh. uh, pues, um, no sé cómo decir eso, pero no sería una industria o si sería más, o, o no, sería más bien un, un servicio. Sí, no. sí, pero acuérdate que cada compañía y pertenece a una industria. Eso es lo que vimos ayer, que, que todas las compañías eh, pertenecen. Primero vimos que era una industria. What is an industry? Yes. Eso es lo que vimos primero. Y luego vimos qué es lo que se necesita para pertenecer a esa industria. Y dijimos que dependiendo 
del producto que las compañías o servicio que las compañías uh, tenían. Así era la industria a, la, a lo que ellos pertenecían. Y vimos unos, unos ejemplos. Uh, déjame enseñarte los ejemplos que vimos ayer. Eh, uh, ¿Puedes ver esto, Emerson? Yes, teacher. Ok. Entonces, uh, aquí... Enseñarte los ejemplos. Hicimos un, un ejercicio donde eh, veíamos acá este ejercicio lo hicimos donde poníamos la, la compañía, en este caso la compañía, y en este lado se veía la industria a que esa compañía pertenecía. Uh, for example, we have banks. Los banks dijimos que pertenecían a la the finance industry. ¿sí? Teníamos los soft drinks. Uh, esa pertenecía a la beverage industry. ¿Por qué? Porque dependiendo del producto que la compañía produce o los servicios que ellas dan, entonces así la industria a lo que ellos pertenecen. Por ejemplo, cardboard boxes, ¿sí? Pertenecía a la packaging industry, porque ellos usan uh, uh, cajas de cartón, entonces es para empaquetar la, las, los, los productos. Luego vimos los buildings. Buildings eran edificios. Y dijimos que ellos, los que construyen buildings y todo eso, pertenecían a the construction, a the construction industry. ¿sí? El mobile, mobile phones pertenecían a de que ver, eh, telecommunication industry. Las medicine pertenecían a, que ver, beer, salud, no, no, finance, ahora para que, a, The pharmaceutical industry. Y los hair salon services pertenecían a DGB, the beauty and personal care industry. Y clothes, los que producen ropa, ¿sí? esos pertenecían a la textile industry. Entonces, si su compañía eh, eh, produce algo, eh, se tiene que tener un... un una industria a la cual pertenece esa industria. Uh -huh. Sí, teacher. Uh, entonces, I think that my company, ¿cómo se dice? Pertenece. Uh, belongs to, yes. Belongs to. Uh, I think that my company belongs to the finance, finance industry. Finance, finance industry, yes. Uh -huh. finance, finance industry. industry yes. No, esa es um, a, a la industria que se pertenece a su, compa su compañía, ¿ya? no especialmente lo que su compañía hace, sino por lo que ella hace, belongs to that uh, industry. Ah, uh, it's okay, teacher. ¿Ya? Yes. Ok, very good. E eso es lo importante, Emerson, que, que, o sea, vea usted qué es, de qué se trata eh, el ejercicio. Y, y está bien equivocarse, no, no hay problema, eso no... No, no, no hay problema. Eh, ya dio la información y ahora ya usted la puede ver. Oh, ok. Entonces, esto es lo que tengo que decir. Esto es lo que te, y estas son las tres partes que mi presentación ten, debería de tener. Tenía que tener eh, mi compañía, eh, expertise de mi compañía y la industria a la que esa compañía pertenece. Hoy ya, ya se dio cuenta que su compañía pertenece a la financing industry. ¿Ya? Okay, teacher. Yes. Very good. Thank you. Thank you, Emerson. Very good. Thank you, teacher. Good, good job, Emerson. Thank you. Okay. Um, if I can have, uh, let's see, Edwin Rodriguez. Yeah. Edwin ya lo dio. Edgar Emerson. Ahora tengo Carlos Antonio Rosales, please. Carlos, no sé. Ok, Carlos no está, Carlos se fue. Es, no, esa es uh, Laura, la canción de Laura. Laura no está, Laura se fue. Esa es otra canción. Eh, Esmeralda, aunque voltee a ver para abajo, le voy a preguntar. <ríe> este, ok, va, estaba va. escuchando lo que están haciendo, así que acabo de, lo intentaré, I try. Oh, you try, ok, más o menos tiene una, una idea. You have an idea about yeah. the, what the presentation should yeah. have. Okay, very good. Go ahead. Go ahead. Okay. Thank you. 
My name is Esmeralda. I work for the educational industry of the country. I work at the Central America School in Sonsonate City. Um, it's a school with 55 years of the training students and professional in Sonsonate City and the country. Okay. My goodness. Very good. I'm impressed. Short, really? con concise, very, but good. Concise, Thank you. Thank but good. You. Eh, eh, compacto, pero, pero bueno, de, me dio lo que necesitábamos. Eh, okay. Industry, eh, expertise, and the name of the company. And it doesn't have uh, um, branches? No. No? It's only, no, no, no. Oh, okay. So we need to talk to the, uh, to the principal. Yeah, well, yeah. We need to talk to the principal of that school. So if it, if it has a, a lot of years of exper experience, they should have branches, you know. Not only Sonsonate have to take the, have the um, advantage. This, eh, como los dueños del colegio también son los dueños de la Universidad de Sonsonate. Entonces, um, tienen como, son como hermanos gemelos. Um, la escuela donde trabajo es desde Barbularia hasta Bachillerato. Entonces, es un colegio grandísimo, de los más grandes de acá del, del departamento. De Sonsonate. I never heard of them before. Nunca oí de ellos anteriormente. Sí, tienen 55 años. 55 years. Sí. Oh my goodness. So the founders are still sí, alive? Sí, obvio. The founders Esa are still hope. alive? Um, uh, no entiendo, teacher. Okay, the founders, los fundadores, are still ah. alive? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yes, um, the founder, uh, la señora sí está aún con vida. El esposo murió hace un oh, par de años. I'm sorry to hear that. Mm -hmm. Okay, very good. Uh, excellent. Good job. Good job, Esmeralda. Very good. Thank you. Thank you. Um, let's see. Uh, okay, me falta. Eric Linares. Eric, 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 Eric. No estás ahí, Eric. No. Ok, Jonathan Zavala. I'm here. Ok. Uh, well, yo entré tarde a la, a la clase ayer, pero más o menos de lo que estoy escuchando intentaré. Good job. Uh, that's a good attitude. Yes, that's, that's the attitude. Very good. Okay, um, good evening, everyone. I'm Jonathan Spala. I'm working for uh, Mi Lote. Is, this is the name of the of, of the, my work. The company. And in the company, sorry. And they buy, como se dice, lotes in English. Uh, Eso se llama, en inglés se llama flats. Flats son los, los lotes. Flats. Yeah. O las casas. Yeah. Okay, we buy, we, we buy and sell uh, flats. Okay. And, and the values is uh, respect, respect and uh, I can remember the word uh, efficiency. Okay, efficiency. Uh, efficiency. Mm -hmm. um, no more. <laughs> okay, what is the industry that they belong to? Uh, the industry, maybe, bienes raíces, pero no recuerdo en inglés. Okay. Is this the industry? No, no. Okay, let's see. De esta que le enseñé yo a Emerson, ¿no viste alguna ahí que, que más o menos se, se más o menos se, se acoplaba? Mm, I don't know. I can remember maybe maybe one, but, but I can remember it. Okay. 
Okay, let me see. See, it's a sunglass. Interested, this is the interested that we have that we were talking about yesterday. And uh, uh, maybe uh, the construction industry. The construction industry, probably, yes. Uh -huh. Okay, that might be the construction industry. We are in the construction build uh, industry, something like that. Okay, so ese era el, 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 la, la tarea de, de verificar qué industria eh, my company belonged to, eh, que pertenecía, ¿verdad? Y que lo que hacíamos es the expertise, de que éramos expertos. En el caso de Esmeralda, su compañía es experta en education. Que sí, a, 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 from a, a, a preschool, preschool all the way to university level so it's a it's, that's their expertise education and uh, they belong to education industry yeah. so that's that that was the uh, uh the assignment and thank uh, thank you jonathan for your participation we appreciate welcome. participating class okay okay very good so um this is what we uh, read yesterday. I don't know if you remember that there were the four people in the conversation. And over here, we have uh, some questions. Uh, uh, and also, uh, we want to make sure that we have uh, 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 understanding about the use of personnel and staff. Both of them are referring to the, per, uh, the people who work in a company. So like a personnel, uh, when we, whenever we use personal, we're going to use a, a plural verb. But uh, when we use staff, we can use either plural verbs or a singular verb. So just make sure that you remember that whenever you're talking about the staff is or the staff are, you can say that. But when you use uh, personnel, in personal, you have to say the personnel are. Yeah, you cannot say the personnel is. For personnel is a plural and uh, we need to use the plural verbs okay that's uh, the only thing that you have to remember of and um let's see if we can complete the questions and then we're going to write uh, let's see we can write the answer you're going to write the answers in your notebooks and the first one is uh, what mario mario and a question mark so this is going to be a question right and remember we use the uh, auxiliary verbs to make a question and uh, we either use do or does. Do, we use do when the, the, uh, uh, um, the pronoun is either I, you, we, you, or they. And we use does when it's a third person singular. So is, uh, whether it's he, she, or it. If, we, if we're using either of them, then we're gonna be using does. So the first one, what do you think the first one should read, uh, Esmeralda? What do you think the question should be? Okay, let me help you. Okay. What is my test? So right here. Hello, nice to meet you, Mrs. What H. Do, what do you do? Uh, it's a third person. What is Mario does? What? What did Mario do? No. Yes. What does? does. Yes. Does. What does? does. Mario. 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 Do. Do. What do. does Mario do? Yes. And uh, what would be the answer? What does Mario do? He's the branch manager. Yes, he's the branch manager. So that is your 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 answer over here. What does Mario do? He is the branch manager. Should say over here. Number two, uh, Senia. What do you do there? What do do? What does? No, a ver. What do you does Leo? Or qué does? Or Leo. 
Pero si, when, when we use a, um, like auxiliary verb, we, we write the verb in the base form, in its base, base form. So if I have, what do you, then the do is the auxiliary verb. Then the verb, the question verb or the verb of the sentence should be in its base form. In this case is what the, what do, what do you, you do, what do Leo. you do, no. Leo, Leo? What do you do, Leo? What yes. do you do, Leo? Leo, and what would be the answer? Leo is charge of the kitchen staff. Yes, in charge of the kitchen staff. Staff, yes, of the kitchen staff. Very good. Uh, number four. Uh, let's see, Manfredi, my number three. Oh, oh, Gomez, help me with number three. What it Nisa does. What does Nisa do? What does what? Nisa do? Yes. And what is the, the answer? Uh, in charge of purchases. Charge of purchases. Yes, she is in charge of purchases. Purchases on compras, right? Eso es purchases. Okay, very good. Excelente. Okay, now on this one is what we went over yesterday. Remember the uh, rules? So look at the words in bold. Uh, bold bolds are the uh, the uh, um, the letters in black, yeah, dark black. That is bold. Bold son las en negritas que se ven. Uh, look at the words in bolds and complete the statements in the box. So what do you do? Yes. What department does Marta manage? Marta manage the sales department. So over here, what would be the question? What do you... What? What department do you supervise? Yes, yes. What department do you supervise? Because I have a maintenance department. So uh, they will be asking me what departments I supervise. Yes, okay. What department do you supervise? See, está aquí. Yes. What, what department do you supervise? What do you do? Yes. Then the third one, it says overseas. What would be the third one? What I, what do you need to do? Universities. Yeah, yes, is. What do you need what to do? What do you oversee? Okay. So if I have over here, I, uh, Claudio oversees the branch in Ilopango. So what branch? What branch oversees? Yes. What branch oversees Claudio? Does Claudio oversees? Uh, that's Claudio oversees. Remember, we, we have to use the do or does. That's the question. Uh, yeah. What, what branch in Ilopango Claudio oversees? Yeah. Yeah. Does oversees. Number four. Anybody, cualquiera. Who do you, who do you report? Uh, who do you report to? No, ¿qué pasa con los assemblers? What department report do you report? Who days? Oh. <laughs> who? 
who the assemblers yes. reports to report to yes there we go the assemblers yes who do the assemblers report to yes so the assemblers report to the supervisors that will be the, the answer so the question will be who do the assemblers report to the assemblers report to the supervisor number five very good number five where do you manufacture okay where where branch do you know no branch no 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 branch no mm -hmm. Where plant do you manufacture? Okay. Where does plant manufacture? No. Not sure. <laughs> no. What WH word we need to use? Remember, we're looking for information what where huh where where no porque estamos uh, 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 buscando no el place sino que dice we manufacture what plant what plant yes what plant you do actually do we or do you? You can say, what plant do we manufacture? We manufacture in the Santa Ana plant. Or what plant do you manufacture in? Yes. What plant do you manufacture in? Or what plant do we manufacture in? We manufacture in the Santa Ana plant. Okay. Number six. See what what's what is douglas do douglas trains the new stuff no do, no 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 what is douglas does no 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 what douglas what is Douglas does now? What is Douglas does now? Who do you train? There we go. Who Douglas? Who does Douglas train? Who? <laughs> yeah. Who does Douglas train? Sin la S, ¿verdad? Train, porque tenemos el does. Who does Douglas train? Douglas trains the new stuff. Yes. See? Yeah. Ok. ¿Alguna pregunta de lo que, de, de lo que hicimos aquí? Si no lo entendió y si no, si le faltó algo ahí... Eh, practíquelo usted solito para, para ver si puede usted eh, elaborar las, las preguntas based on the answer to the question. ¿Sí? Basado en la respuesta, usted formule la pregunta y el verbo que le dan aquí, of course, ¿verdad? Eh, formule la pregunta para esta respuesta. Y cuando la haya formulado, when you have a formulated of uh, uh, your the question, then ask the question and answer it as well. So if it makes sense, then you're correct. If it doesn't make sense, um, you have to rewrite it again until you get it right, okay? Entonces, eso para los que, yeah, para los que más o menos dijeron, no, no, no entendí esto, yeah. Okay, aquí está otro, otra, otra actividad que tenemos que hacer, role play, a two minute conversation. Remember, it doesn't have to be two minutes. It can be 30 seconds, 15 seconds, as long as you give the information that is requested. In este caso, the information that is re being requested is a role play, a two minute 
conversation, introducing yourself and staff to someone else at a business event. Seminar, los business events, ¿cuáles son, verdad? Seminar, training, or product presentation. Take turns asking and answering questions like the ones in the model conversation, okay? Model conversation, esta es la model conversation, yeah? Esto es, entonces, ¿qué es lo que vamos a hacer? We're going to introduce ourselves and the staff to someone else in the business. Entonces, ¿cómo lo vamos a hacer? Aquí está la respuesta. ¿Se acuerdan aquí? El staff introducing Mario, yeah? ¿Cómo pasó aquí? ¿Cómo nos los presentamos? Hello, good morning. Are you Mr. Young? ¿Es esa presentación? ¿Es esa cuando yo me presento? Es una pregunta que le estoy haciendo. Eh, ¿Es esa como yo me presento? ¿O a ustedes, cualquier persona se presenta? Hello, good morning. Are you Mr. John? No, ¿verdad? No. Entonces, ¿dónde es que se presenta? Se presenta en la third line. Y en la tercera línea se presenta. I am Miss State. I am the trainer. Ya, yeah, eso es presentarse, ¿verdad? I am Mr. Machuca. I am uh, the English instructor. Ya, yeah, o I am the English teacher. Eso es presentarme yo. I am the English teacher. Ya. Yeah. Y luego, ¿cuál es lo más que se pide? Presentar a otra persona, ¿verdad? This is Mario. He's the branch manager. And this is, and this is Leo. Ya. Yeah. Eso es presentar a otra persona. Entonces, ¿cómo vamos a hacer? ¿Cómo va a ser la, la actividad mañana? Vamos a tener Senia, Esmeralda y Gómez, por ejemplo, ¿verdad? Es un ejemplo. Entonces, uh, y Senia va a decir, Good, uh, I am Senia. Uh, I am the, uh, no sé, cualquier, cualquier posición. Usted puede inventar cualquier posición. Y I am the trainer, puede decir, o I am the, uh, the owner of the company, or I am the accountant, I am the uh, human resources uh, uh, director, or cualquier otra, or I'm, I'm the machine operator, I am the secretary, I am the uh, uh, a finance advisor, lo que usted quiera, yes. Entonces, eso es lo, lo que va a decir, y luego va a, a introduce a otra persona, en este caso a Gómez, Gómez, Let me introduce uh, the staff. If I say, this is uh, Esmeralda. She is, y Esmeralda le va a decir qué es lo que ella quiere ser, ¿verdad? Uh, this is Esmeralda. She is uh, uh, the branch manager. And this is uh, uh, Edwin, ¿ya? Yeah. Entonces, Edwin, eh, ¿qué va a decir Edwin? Cuando le digan, well, welcome, le va a decir Esmeralda, nice to meet you. Nice meeting you too, Esmeralda. Um, uh, you, Leo, what do you do, Leo? Le va a preguntar Esmeralda. Y Leo, o en este caso Edwin, va a decir, nice, uh, nice to meet you. I am in charge of the... Y él dice de qué es lo que está en charge. Entonces, eh, es importante que podamos uh, ver dónde va la complejidad de esto. La complejidad de esto es que usted está introducing yourself and introducing other people, y la otra people se introduce a otra persona, y esta persona eh, se introduce, eh, introduce con la otra persona y dice de lo que trabaja y cuál es su posición. De eso se va a tratar la, el ejercicio mañana, ¿ok? Entonces, uh, practique eso de introduction, uh, practique de cómo introduce a otra persona. This is, yeah. This is uh, Gómez. Uh, he is in charge. Oh, he is the manager. He is y en la posición de esa persona. Entonces, good afternoon or good evening. My name is Antonio and I am uh, your English teacher. Okay, la otra persona. Nice to meet you, Mr. Antonio. Okay, this is uh, Mario or this is uh, Gomez or cualquier cosa. Okay. ¿Alguna pregunta de lo que vamos a hacer mañana? No. Okay, good. Mañana van a aparecer las preguntas, ¿verdad? 
<laughs> ok. Um, ok, this is lo que estuvimos hablando al principio. Networking. ¿Te acuerdas de networking? La, la, la introduction for la, para la clase de hoy. Estuvimos hablando acerca de qué era networking. What a networking is. Eh, if, if what we're going to do is uh, we will describe past networking experiences in business events. O sea, ¿qué es lo que pasó en esas reuniones que tuvimos eh, de, de anteriores? Pero antes de eso, tenemos que saber qué es networking. Y what is networking is the question. Are you good at networking in business event? Quiere decir que si usted es buena a comunicarse en los, uh, eh, en los eventos de negocio que hay, ¿verdad? Ya vimos cuáles pueden ser. Puede ser una conferencia, un, un seminar, ¿ya? o cualquier otra cosa de miren. La otra pregunta es, do you often share business, business cards when you network? Eh, los expertos eh, eh, aconsejan o they advise us to always uh, keep a business card with us. Business card es una, es una tarjeta de presentación. Esa es la business card. Yeah. Una tarjeta de presentación. Every time we go to a conference or, or we have a seminar, they advise uh, people to always keep a business card with them because they might need it. They might get a, a like a job offer. ¿sí? Entonces, cuando usted adquiere una job offer, usted da su business card. Here is my business card. And this is my expertise. And this is what I do. And this is where I work. So it's a good idea to get uh, uh, something with you so you can, you can share the business card with other people. Okay, so... This is the, uh, the, the conversation that we're going to be practicing about the networking. Listen to your teacher, read the conversation, then practice with a partner. Okay, here we go. It's uh, Luis and Jeanette. Did you enjoy the seminar? That's the first question, right? Did you enjoy the seminar? That is a close or open question, Senia. Open question. Um, okay, can you try it again? Puede probar otra vez? It's a close or open question? Oh, sorry. It's a close. It's a close question. Yeah, because the answer yeah. is yes. Yes or no. Or no, yes. Did you enjoy the seminar? Yes, I did. I learned a lot. Tell me more. Is a yes a close or open question? Tell me more. Open. I will be open because you have the chance to extend your answer, right? I updated my networking skills. I learned to move from small to smart talk. Great, Lisa Luis. Great. So did you make new contacts? Close question. Yes, I did. I exchanged the business cards with 10 people. Awesome. Awesome. Es una expresión que usan cuando fabuloso, eh, genial. Yes. Eso se, quiere decir la palabra awesome. Yeah. Y no la vayan a pronunciar always some. Yes. Sino que eh, W E es muda. Entonces solo se escucha awesome. Awesome. Awesome, ¿ya? Yeah? Okay. Es una palabra buena para aprenderla. Awesome. Eh, ¿Cómo te dice el lunes que vayan a trabajar? Hey, how do you feel today? Awesome, awesome, ¿ya? Yeah? Esa es la buena actitud que queremos. Ok, alguna pregunta de las... Eh, este diálogo está más fácil. Se puede ser, se ve que no está tan complejo como los que hemos leído anteriormente. Vamos a tener a Wilfredo y a Esmeralda Noemí. Um, reading the dialogue, please. Okay, Esmeralda, go ahead, please. Yeah, ladies first, yes. Okay. <laughs> okay. Uh, <laughs> did you enjoy the seminar? Yes, I did. I learned a lot. Tell me more. I updated my, network, my networking skills. I learned to move from small to smart talk. Great. So did you make new contacts? Yes, I did. I exchanged business cards with 10 people. 
Awesome. Awesome. Very good. Hey, Esmeralda, great. So did you, did you, did you, did yeah, you, did you make did new you. contacts? So Very good. Did you new contacts. Very good. Excellent. Uh, switch places, please. Okay. Did you enjoy the seminar? Yes, I did. I learned a lot. Tell me more. I update my new working skills and I learn, I learn you to move from small to small talk. Great. So, did you make new contacts? Yes, I did. I, I exchanged a business card with uh, 10 people. Awesome. 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 Awesome, awesome. Very good. Excellent. Good job. Excellent. Good job. Eh, Esmeralda, en las terminaciones de estas, ED, ED, por ejemplo, la primera se oye updated. 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 Yes. Updated. Updated. Yes. Updated. Yes. Y esta se, se escucha learned. Learned. Yes, there we go. Learned. 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 Yes. Learned. Okay. Son terminaciones del pasado. Mañana vamos a aprender acerca de estas. Okay. Very good. Excellent. Okay. Uh, let me call roll and uh, we're going to call the night. Uh, and uh, let's see. I'm going to tell you who is, uh, whose turn to stay 10 minutes is. Okay. One second. So I can't. Uh, Okay. Learn job. One second. Okay, one second. Second, almost there. <laughs> Okay, we have uh, Carlos Antonio Rosales. No, es Armen Freddy. Es Armen Freddy. I'm here. I'm here. Thank you. Dennis Vladimir. Present. Thank you. Edgar Edemir. Present. Thank you. Edwin Alexis. Present. Thank you, Emerson Celi. 
pleasure, teacher. Thank you, Eric. Armando. <laughs> Eric Armando. No. Okay. Eh, Esmeralda Noemi. Present teacher. Thank you. Giovanni Alexander. Giovanni Alexander. Giovanni. Okay. Present, sí. Okay. Emer, uh, Emer Alberto. Emer, no. Okay. Uh, Jacobo de Jesús. Present teacher. Thank you. Uh, Jonathan Salvador. Present teacher. Thank you. Jorge Alberto Rellana Martinez. Present teacher. Thank you. Uh, Maria Jesus Martinez. Present. Thank you. Mario Osvaldo. Present. And Melissa Esther. Present. Thank you, Melissa. Okay, um, hoy le toca a Imer Alberto Sánchez quedarse, ¿verdad? The rest of you, you can go and rest. All right, have a good night. See you tomorrow. Good night. Bye. Okay. Good night. Thank you, teacher. Good night. Thank you, Esmeralda. Have a good night. Rest well. ¿Y qué es eso? Ahí me se fue. Uh -huh.